Well, good evening, lovely ladies and gentlemen. Steve, AJ Collins coming to you from Georgia, San Antonio, Texas. The second most powerful, passionate, purposeful coach and speaker in the world. Freaking out right now because Gabriella is driving. Yeah, it's that time learning to drive. You would think with seven kids it would get easier. You know, there's certain things that get easier with time. Uh, and then there are things like, you know, hitting your thumb with a hammer. Doesn't matter how many times you hit your thumb with a hammer, it hurts every single time. So tonight's video is when you're working in your business more than you're working on your business, you're basically delaying growth. Okay, you can go first because you got here first. Go. Yeah. <sighs> when you're working in your business more than you're working on your business in terms of disproportionate amounts of time, you're delaying growth. What does that mean exactly? Well, if you're in real estate, I'll tell you exactly what that means. You can roll the windows up if you want to make. What that means is if you find yourself working with clients, serving clients, what's the speed limit? Speed limit? Yeah. When you're working with clients, showing houses, listing houses, looking at the MLS, entering information, doing all of the data, doing all of the research, you're working in your business. You're doing the stuff of working in the business. And if you ever have a desire to grow or become bigger, you're going to have to learn to time block working on your business. What does that mean? Your business will only grow to the extent that you grow. You will not be able to grow the business unless you grow as a person. You can't just say, hey, it'd be really awesome to have a team. I'd like to have a lot of people doing what you are continually doing because your job description changes. The skill set that it requires to sell is not the skill set that it requires to lead and to train and to motivate and to encourage and to build other people up. It is an entirely different skill set which requires people to invest a significant amount of time in developing that new skill set. And for the most part, it's messy. So why, you didn't come to a complete stop I at all. If there's a cop, car. no, if there's a cop behind I us, we'd have got a ticket. No, man, it's serious. So oh, I'm working oh, on my parenting instead oh, of in my, like, now I'm oh, in my parenting, yeah, and then I gotta work on my parenting. On my parenting is the books that I read, the tapes and videos that I listen to, the authors that I study, all of these different people help me work on my parenting before I'm in this situation working in my parenting, which tonight is freaking out with Gabriella driving. So learning how to block periods of time to study what it is that you need to study so that you can actually be working on your business. What does that look like? That looks like a weekly meeting at a minimum. That looks like time that you are investing in the people that you are serving. That means finding intentional, purposeful ways to grow the people that you are working with. Intentional ways for you to develop so that they can develop. It means studying and researching and planning and studying leadership. So what happens when you do that? You get a chance to grow and grow other people. Ella, you're going way past the speed limit. You know, this isn't, this isn't funny at all. I mean, you need to chill. So, yes, there is. So, at the end of the day, if you're working in your business more than you're working on your business, all you are doing is simply delaying growth. And the reason that you like to work in your business more than on your business is working in your business is fun, it's free, it's exciting, it's cool, it's awesome, it feels natural and exciting and cool. Why are you stopping in the street, sweetheart? Baby doll, please? Like, just go. Not <laughs> fall asleep, don't talk like that. Slowing down to get stuff right and learn a new skill working on the business is the key to putting yourself in a position to begin to actually grow. Are you working in your business more than on your business? Well, you're just delaying your growth. Have a great evening, guys.